learn about examples of number sentences. Part 2. Let's say we have a problem like 3.5 over D is equal to 14 over 15. Find D. Now, let's first rewrite this equation. equal to 15 over 2 times 2, which is equal to 4. 15 over 4, which is equal to 3 and 3 fourths. So D is equal to 15 over 4, which is equal to 3 and 3 fourths. So D is equal to 3 and 3 fourths. So, once again, for this problem, 3.5 over D is equal to 14 over 15. Find D. Now, we can erase this question mark and put 3 and 3 fourths. 3 and 3 fourths. to another problem. Y over 18 is equal to 
2.4 over 15. 2.4 over 15. Now, the first step in solving this problem is using cross multiplication. That means we multiply y with 15 and 2.4 to 15, y is equal to 2.4 times 18. Let's rewrite this down here. 15y, 15y is equal to 2.4 times 18. 2.4 times 18. Now, we need to find out how much y is equal to. So we have to divide both sides of the equation by 15. So 15y over 15 is equal to 2.4 times 18 over 15. 15. The 15 crosses out with the 15. So y is equal to 2.4 times 18 over 15. Now, let's rewrite 2.4 as a fraction. So it becomes y is equal to 2.4, written as a fraction, is 24 over 10 times 18 over 15. 18 over 15. Now, let's simplify this down. 18 and 10 are both divisible by 2. 18 divided by 2 is 9. And 10 divided by 2 is equal to 5. 24 and 15 are both divisible by 3. So 24 divided by 3 is equal to 8. And 15 divided by 4, or divided by 3, is equal to 5. So it becomes y is equal to 8 over 5 times 9 over 5. 8 times 9 is equal to 72 over 5 times 5 is equal to 25. 72 over 25 is equal to 2 and 23, actually 22 over 25. So, once again, for this problem, which is y over 18 is equal to 2.4 over 15, find y. y is equal to, no more question mark, can erase the question mark and put down 2 and 22 over 25. 2 and 22 over 25. Today we 